welcome back to my channel you guys so as you can see from the title of this video we are doing a hair review so it's been a while since i've done a hair review and honestly i've missed them i really really have missed them so yeah anyway let's get into it oh and before we begin don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below and also hit the like button if you enjoyed this video i will have all links everything down below okay so the wig we are going to be reviewing today is the bobby boss tessa wig so yeah i almost forgot what i was reviewing i purchased this wig a few months ago and it's literally just been sitting right there in my room i haven't had the like urge to even open up a new wig or anything like that i've been wearing my old ones and just getting my hair braided back and forth back and forth but today we are finally gonna open her and it is a bob wig perfect for the summertime that was mainly the reason i purchased it was because of the hot heat but i purchased it and still ended up wearing my 20 two inch wig so you know i have problems but the summer is not over yet and i'm gonna be taking it out now and you guys so far i've only literally been reviewing bobby boss wigs i don't know like i just had such a good experience with my first bobby Bob bobby boss wig that i always just purchased bobby boss and they're really good synthetic wigs so especially the short ones the long ones i can't really say for sure but the short ones of course is short it doesn't tangle as fast so it's just less manageable and you can keep it for longer yeah i'll tag all my other well i will link all my other bobby boss wigs reviews wig reviews down below as well so this is what the wig looks like right here it's a bob wig a middle part bob wig and it says it's a deep part basically all bobby boss wigs well their wigs that i've purchased always had a deep part so yeah and i purchased it in the color 1b this time i decided to be safe and just play 1b last time i purchased um bobby boss wigs i just purchased um colorful wigs um last time yeah I think the last one was a blonde wig and then before that it was a blue teal wig but yeah so this is how the wig comes out straight out the box I got it in the color 1B like I think I said that but yeah this is how it comes packaged really well and look at this perfect bob wig you guys i haven't i have not had a bob wig in a minute okay uh, it's just been a minute so this is the wig i'm just gonna take all this extra stuff off i don't need that this to keep his shape this to keep his shape this to keep his shape and here is the wig let me i'm just gonna cut this part out as okay so here is the wig right here. Let me just zoom out a little. So here is the wig right here. Honestly, it's super soft. It's like a yakky texture. Yeah, it's like a yakky texture. That's literally what it feels like. And I just love the cut on this. It's not, it doesn't look like it's too short, but you know, I don't I don't know. And The lace is brown. You can literally see that. It's brown. It looks reddish, but it's kind of it's brown in real life. And there's the parts. And they always have the wig structured the same way. One comb in the back, two on the sides, and then the deep part. That's that's the same for all of their wigs. I haven't been receiving any shedding. Yeah, that's, I'm going to cut off the lace and come back on camera for you guys. Okay, so I cut off the lace. I ended up cutting some of the hair off, but I think that's okay. It'll be alright. <laughs> so I already have on my brown wig cap, 
purchased this from the beauty supply store these are perfect for me especially the color i don't have to deal with putting foundation or powder on it <sighs> I look like Lord Farquhar. Farquhar. <laughs> but yeah, let's put the wig. Oh, I. Should I change? That felt a little tight. Um, okay. That. It fits like really, really perfect. It fits really, really perfect. But I'm definitely gonna have to put some powder into this. Like, I need to cover up some of these knots right here. That's not cute. But the lace, the wig, the wig fits perfectly. So if you're like around my head shape, I think this wig will be like, fit you so well. Their wigs always fit me like snug anyway. I feel like they made the wig for me. So yeah, let me just, and the way it's fitting, it's like, if, like I said, it fits like it's made for my head. That's weird, but okay. One, the wig is shedding. The wig is shedding. The wig is shedding. Okay, it's shedding. Like, why are you why are you shedding? Oh, is that because I cut the thing? I did cut into the lace where the hair was as well, so that's probably what that is. Cause now it's not shedding anymore. Maybe that's just from what I cut. wow that's beautiful so let me show you guys like the full 360 of the wig so. yeah that's pretty much such a, that's actually very very pretty okay so i'm gonna take the wig off i'm gonna put some powder in it and i'm probably gonna pluck open this part right here just like in the beginning part, it's it looks like it's closed off. So I'm just going to use my tweezers and just pluck that part out. Put powder on the inside and outside because I always do that. I feel like it opens up the lace more. So, yeah. I'm going to just take this shit off camera. <sighs> that feels good. Yeah, see how like easy that was? You just put it on and put it off. So, oh, I'm using my MAC powder. This is in the color Deep Darkest mineralized skin finish i've had this powder for years but yeah i'm gonna use actually i'm gonna use my tweezers first take my little tweezers and just open up this part right here oh and if you don't be careful with bobby boss wigs like when you're plucking you will tear a hole in it i've done that with my other bobby boss wig before and yeah it's not cute so just be careful so you don't tear a hole in your wig because once that happens like it's just hard to go back honestly oh this is how i'm doing it by the way <laughs> i know you guys can't see so i'm gonna show it to y'all just like that you guys can see i just opened up the front part because it was just doing too much that was just so closed off before but much better so I'm just now gonna use the powder and just going through the parts you can see how putting powder is just opening that up right this is the part I haven't put powder yet that's where I put the powder Especially if you're like me and you wear makeup, it's best to do this because sometimes when you put makeup on, your face just gets either a little bit brighter. So this, the powder just tends to make everything seamlessly blend together. I'm just going to put the wig back on. Every time I put this on, <laughs> it looks like Lord Farquhar. Lord Farquhar. okay so i know i wasn't bugging but do y'all see how much that opened up the the parting i really really love doing that part doing that like b 
beautiful and it's flat okay we're not gonna do baby hair because I want you guys to see how it, the wig can still look nice when you don't know how to do baby hair either so I think it's I think it's nice it's a really beautiful wig wow okay 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 let me see how it looks behind my ear do I want to do that yeah let's see let's see how it looks when you tuck it behind your ear wow behind the ear it looks really nice behind the ear um and then when you leave it oh why am i liking it like this more than like this okay <laughs> okay let's see let's see let's see I'm gonna leave the wig like this. I actually really, really like it like this. I also like it behind the ear too. I don't really have a problem with either. It looks really nice. <laughs> I think I've talked about the texture already. It's like a light yakky. It's kind of smoothish, but you still feel the, you know, the yakkyish texture on it. So this is very, very beautiful. This wig. Oh, by the way, it stopped shedding. So I'm pretty sure it's because of when I cut the lace and I cut into the hair itself, which is why that hair was coming out. But um, it's a synthetic wig. Over the weeks, it is going to start to shed and just mat up, but it's synthetic. But being that the wig is short, it's not going to tangle. Like, I've had Bobby Boss hair before and I've had the wig. I remember, I forgot which wig it was. Um, I'll link it down below though. Um, I did a review on it. And that wig, I wore that wig for like four months. That wig was not tangling. It wasn't doing anything like that. Um, I think it was the Yara wig. What is it? It was the Yara wig, yeah. It was the Bobby Boss Yara, and I had it in the color teal. I also had it in the one B color, but I wore the teal. I wore the one B one for such a long time, and it just never gave up on me. Like it just never did, and I ended up even doing like a review on it afterwards because it was still in good shape. So anyway, yeah. That wig was a short bob, was a bob, well it was a long bob and that did not mat up or anything like that. So I really, really have high hopes for this one. I'm really glad I decided to just take it out and finally see what it's all about because I really was playing games. You guys seen that video? I need to find that video and like put it in this clip because it's hilarious. Like it's hilarious. The guys, you know, when you get your hair done and Yo, I wish I could do that. But his bow was shorter and he was just... <laughs> Yo, that shit is hilarious. Anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna tag... Why do I keep saying tag? I'm gonna link this video down in the description box. Make sure you check it out. Make sure you check out Bobby Ball. They really do have some good synthetic wigs. Um, This one was... This one is definitely... About to be my go-to wig for the summer i really really like it it looks so cute and adorable like uh, adorable and i never have bobs like the only bob you ever see me with is ones that i probably cut myself and it's just because i didn't want the hair was too long and i just chopped chopped each side that's as much as it goes into that but anything like that's very shaped and like this i've never had and I'm really glad I decided to try it because I think it really frames my face. I really like it. Really, really frames my face. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit the like button. And of course, hit the subscribe button. You guys, we are growing. But I want us to grow more. So, share this video with your friends. Share this video with anyone, you know. Just anyone. Share the video. And of course, subscribe. Subscribe. Follow me on all my social media. And that will be it for this video. And I hope I see you guys next time.